Um, I'm very excited. This is the best way ever to start a day. And that is to see a community that has come together that with support, very important support from the United States Department of Agriculture will have additional funding to really help us scale up what we've been trying to do, especially in the last couple of years during the disruptions that we've had, supply chain, COVID, and many, many, many other challenges. Supporting local farmers, small-scale farmers, farmers of color, women farmers, the vast majority of California farmers are on less than 200 acres. They are small-scale farmers. And we are building systems so that's more local procurement, which is so important. It's bringing some certainty, some ready-made markets to these farmers, whether it's to schools or whether it's to food banks, which we've learned are such an important distribution channel that we can now think about as part of our business model. In doing that and supporting these local farmers with this scale of procurement, we are supporting local economies and we're building stronger, more resilient communities that are coming together to do the most important and most noble cause that I know of. And that's what a farmer does every day, grow food for people and making sure that people in need have access to the most nutritious, which I always think is the most locally produced, but fresh. We have an outstanding partnership with other state agencies, and I have the pleasure of introducing one of my colleagues, but I especially want to call out our history of over 15 years of partnering with the California Association of Food Banks on our Farm to Family program, where we really, at that time, started focusing on the nutrition in the box, and because we are the state of California with all of this fabulous fresh produce, making sure that a good portion of that box included fresh, local produce for better nutrition. And one of my favorite partners is Kim Johnson, the director of the Department of Social Services, who houses the food, the food bank program. I'm not gonna talk about what we're going to do with our grant, I'm just gonna say it really focuses on local procurement, seniors who are in many of our rural areas and are underserved, and farmer-led aggregator hubs to really make the system work and scale it up to new levels. Thank you, Secretary Vilsack, for making this announcement today. And Kim, it's such a pleasure to partner with you. Thank you.